Ah, another review. I just bought this from Bunnings today. And uh, spring is in the air here in Melbourne. So uh, a tiny little handheld pruder might be the way to go for some very, very small jobs. Yep. So I was actually deciding between uh, the Yozito Shredder or the Rio B1, but apparently it's a better build, obviously. Apparently, not obviously, apparently. So uh, take note of this little replacement warranty. If you were to um, register it online, you get a six year tool uh, replacement warranty and a three year battery and charger warranty. So I bought this at Bunnings at uh, $169 with the whole kit with batteries and chargers, a charger, 1.5 amp hour battery and um, yeah, let's have a look. I don't know what this is for, we'll soon find out. I've got time to that tiny little uh, shredder. And you've got this little thing here, a 20, 20 centimeter shredder. Got a little charger here, 18 volts, 1.5 amps. So, um, this tiny little knob here, <laughs> not much to it, is there? No, not, not much indeed. Uh, where's the battery? Oh, yes, here's the battery. I'm trying to do this with one hand. The model number uh, B18L15B lithium ion. Yeah. So apparently, it can be used for drill, it's universal. Uh, so, this is my first investment to, uh, to the Ryobi range. I actually have an AEG cordless, but uh, AEG products is the cordless products are, are quite limited. And they're rather expensive, so this is my first venture. Once you go Ryobi, you won't go back, I suppose. <laughs> and this is it. Yes, the plastics certainly do feel a lot uh, better than the, um, the Zero range. What's this one? Uh, yeah. Anyway, it claims here on no load. It should last to up to 54 minutes on no load, one time. So with load, maybe 20 minutes at maximum. Anyway, we'll give it a good charge and uh, we'll see what's how it performs. Okay, let's try and uh, assemble this little thing here. So this is what this little thing here looks like, the head the battery section. I've got the battery here all fully charged so uh, just a matter of slotting it in using one hand operation it clicks so to activate it it's a two button operation a little safety switch that's how it is now Earlier, when I took out of the box, I didn't know what this this thing was for. So, uh, so apparently this little two little edge shredder and this tiny little one that goes zzz, like a maybe it's good for trimming a haircut. <laughs> so that apparently goes in here. Let's try and see if I can do this with a one hand operation. Maybe not. I'm trying to hold my phone camera. Hang anyway, on. I'll, I'll, I'll take this one. This a little long. Push it in. To see how it is, easy it is. That's what little thing. I'll just turn it up. And apparently that's how easy it is. And just take it off. Let's see an operation.
Anyway, I've actually finished charging the battery and I've sort of noticed why is this, this thing so small, so flimsy? It doesn't look very good. It doesn't look great. It's just like a for a $169 kit, you would expect something a little bit better. Well, that's just me. Intelligent port charging system. Yeah, well, when it's uh, when the battery is not good, apparently that's it, there's a little red dot here. When it's charging, that thing flashes, and when it's steady, that little green light, if it's steady, steady green light, that means it's fully charged, and you take it off. But um, yeah, I think uh, you can do better, Ryobi. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna activate it. Hmm. I wonder how many minutes it will last with this 1.5 amp hour battery. Let's give it a go. It's a light little tool. How, how much does it weight? Probably about maybe two and a half kilos in weight. The reason why I was I actually bought this thing is because I was actually uh, sick and tired of actually using my corded hitch trimmer, the long one. So. Um, Hopefully with a battery it makes it a little bit more uh, easier. Feels as if it struggles a little bit. There it is, folks. Oh, did you hear that? It was uh, struggling. The battery was fully charged. So. So, it does struggle a little bit, so I reckon the box says that, um, what, about 56 minutes or 50 minutes with no load, so I reckon with load, it'll probably last about 15 minutes on and off use, but uh, yeah, so unless, if you want to use it a little bit longer, I suggest you Buy a bigger battery pack. It wouldn't be cheap. 
It won't be cheap. So my verdict is, yeah, it's good for uh, light application use. That's about it. It's a small hedger. Small trim hedger. So there you go. That's all folks. Enjoy.